Well, a key example, I think, of what we've seen from the Conservatives in government in terms of having a majority and having lots of talk, uh, but very little action has been on the BBC licence fee. Of course, we saw Nadine Dorries a while ago when she was Culture Secretary say that the BBC licence fee next announcement would be the last. Essentially, that the uh, TV tax would be scrapped from 2028. And she said at the time, Nadine Dorries, that this licence fee announcement will be the last the days of the elderly being threatened with prison sentences and bailiffs knocking on doors are over. And it was now time to discuss and debate new ways of funding, supporting and selling great British content. Of course, you then saw Michelle Donnellan come in as the next culture secretary, indicating that the BBC licence fee was impossible to sustain. And indeed, she had, before getting the role of culture secretary, had hit out at the BBC licence fee, describing it as an unfair tax that should be scrapped altogether. And that's then been followed by the next culture secretary in Lucy Fraser, who said that she's looking very closely at the BBC licence fee and that it could be scrapped, that the government are looking at this. And I think this is an interesting case study into how looking at things and considering things, but actually doing naff all. The way that you actually waste a majority given to you by Conservative voters at the last election. You only have to look at the research out there now from the likes of YouGov to see that the BBC being funded by advertising and subscription far more popular, has far more public support than it being funded by the current licence fee or indeed through general taxation. When, when you look at Conservative voters there, the research from YouGov finding 43% of Conservative voters support the BBC being funded by advertising and a further 19% say they support a subscription model, a clear majority of Tory voters back in advertising or subscription to fund the BBC. But after all the talk we've seen, Lucy Fraser on the BBC talking about the BBC licence fee and as I said, being pretty non-committal. Watch this and let me know. Do you have faith in the Conservatives to actually listen to the public and their own voters and go ahead and ditch the BBC licence fee? Or are we just going to see more of the same and a massive Conservative U-turn here? One of your predecessors, Nadine Dorries, said the current settlement would be the last. So in other words, licence fees on the way out. Do you agree? I think the BBC is a phenomenal British institution. So I mentioned, you know, the 200 dignitaries uh, that came over over the weekend and mm -hmm. I had an opportunity to speak to many of them uh, who talk about uh, uh, the soft power of the UK. Mm -hmm. That means, you know, recognising our values uh, overseas and the BBC is part of that. So should the licence fee stay then? We do need to look at and we're reviewing, as you will know, we're reviewing mm -hmm. the charter and mm -hmm. we will be looking at the licence fee. But and the licence fee is one of that. And I do think we need to think about the way the BBC uh, is funded, but it is important that it gets the resources that it needs in able to continue to be the fantastic institution. But that it are is. you disagreeing then with Nadine Dorries, who said very clearly as culture secretary, you're now culture secretary, she said the last, the licence fee settlement, as it stands would be the last in other words the license we firmly in her view was on the way out is that your view well we are reviewing the license fee i've started that review i'll be listening to a, a number of people including the bbc mm -hmm. um, i do think it will have to look very closely at its funding arrangement we will be looking very closely at its funding arrangement um, and uh, that is something that we will be looking at very seriously in due course but i'm just trying to understand is it your instinct that basically therefore the license fee should go ultimately well, I, I know you want to press me, and I've just said that we are starting that process, and I do think it's really important mm. that the BBC gets this funding, but uh, I do think it might need to look at a variety of sources uh, for its funding, but I'm starting that review at the moment, and I don't want to prejudge that. But it's a variety of sources. What do you mean by that? Well, I've just started this review. I'm very happy to come on in the future to discuss it. I'd like to ensure the BBC is properly funded. The licence fee isn't the only 